appearing on ITV's Good Morning Britain yesterday the Voice UK coach, 43, could barely contain his anger when asked about it, saying, that statement was one of the most ignorant statements that anybody that came from the hood could ever say about their ancestors, that slavery is a choice, what are you talking about, despite once being friends, pictured above, with a controversial musician the Black Eyed Peas singer admits he no longer recognizes him, adding, that's not Kanye, that's a different person saying that and I hope it's not to raise awareness so he could sell a record and some shoes, that would be the worst thing to do to stir up a very touchy race situation and be the benefactor from it, addressing 40-year-old Kanye directly, he says, I encourage you, if you really believe this, give your shoes away for free, give your album away for free, I will not throw my ancestors under the bus to profit. My grandmother's grandma was a slave. And when you're a slave you're owned, you don't choose if you're owned. When you're a slave you're deprived of education. That's not choice, that's by force, blank, underscore IT was a starry night at the official opening of Chess which returns to London's Coliseum Theatre 32 years after it first premiered in the West End. Enjoying themselves at the after-show party were cast. Members Tim Hower, Cassidy Jansen, former Strictly star Alexandra Bork and the Grand Master of Musicals Michael Ball. The 1980s set show is a collaboration between lyricist Sir Tim Rice and Abba's Benny Anderson and Bjorn Alvaeus and features the hit song I Know Him So Well, made famous by Elaine. Page and Barbara Dixon who took it to number one for four weeks in 1985, thankfully the celebrity-packed press night went off without a hitch. This is in stark contrast to the show's first preview which saw lead actor Tim dash off during the interval when his wife went into labor, before being replaced by understudy Sel and Chug Jones who earned rave reviews for his short notice stint, blank, underscore Julianne Moore had no idea she'd been the victim of UAL harassment until she heard other stories of women affected and realized should experience similar. When this movement started I felt sure I hadn't personally been a victim of UAL harassment or assault, says, the 57-year-old, but as I read and listened to the countless other women's stories I began to look at my experiences through a different lens. Our understanding of what is acceptable has been skewed by the fact that egregious behavior has been normalized by society and those who speak out have been stigmatized. Julianne has accused director James Tabak of making unwanted advances towards her in the 1980s, which he has denied blank, underscore TV presenter Monty Don clearly doesn't think much of the BBC's decision to air the World Snooker Championship instead of an episode of Gardener's World during National Gardening Week, not sure what it tells us but interesting that the BBC elected to replace Gardener's World with Snooker. During National Gardening Week, fumes the 62-year-old, a ham, Gardener's World presenter on Twitter before adding, Six but a Beeb spokesperson has justified the decision, saying, Gardener's World is a key part of the BBC Two schedule, but our commitment to live sport, which is also enjoyed by the BBC Two audience, does sometimes mean that programming is subject to change, blank, underscore perhaps in a bid to tap into a new market Sting randomly appeared on a live quiz app to promote his new album. Users of HQ Trivia were shocked when the Don't Stand So Close To Me singer popped up on screen and sidled up to host Sharon Carpenter. The 66-year-old gave some shout-outs before wishing the 200,000 players good luck. It's the latest surprise from the former police frontman who recorded his latest record, snappily titled 44876. With an unlikely musical sidekick, Jamaican dancehall star Shaggy.